So I was going to show you like how these rails go, but I uh, printed all of the same corners. It's supposed to be a, a mirrored and then the regular one. So I'll we'll have to reprint those. I won't wait a day or two. I'll have it done. And I'll show you how I cut these, and it was pretty simple. I just used a, a pipe cutter that you'd use for like cutting water pipe. Kind of dulls the blade on it, but we got the job done. Just need to do two of them. Not that big a deal. The plastic cost a total of 30 bucks with screw ups I think. So it should be okay. While I'm waiting for other stuff to happen, I show you this. So the belts slide hook into these and these slide into the tops. Or should slide into the tops. That one's been sanded on. You know the ones that have it pretty tight on mine. Again, I think it's over extrusion when I printed them. I should have been more careful. But when you're not more careful, you can get out the old sandpaper. <laughs> Now I don't really have a system since I've only kind of done one. I just do the flat sides first or where it looks boogered up. But the bottoms look a little heavy on these. I think that's elephant's foot. You know, it doesn't take much. They start cleaning up. We're not building a space shuttle here. Of course, if the belts don't fit in the tops, they probably don't fit in the bottoms either. We can do the two that I have printed. We still got to reprint the other two, so I'll just do those off camera, but you know. You probably don't care to see any more sanding. It's not all that exciting. Email me. I'll send you all the sanding you want. Well, here we're going to assemble the trucks. They each have five bolts and five bearings. This one I already did. I went in, so I knew I could do it. So. These are your tension bolts. They say pay attention to which way they're going. It's all on this website. You do not tighten these all the way. You don't even snug them up. Push it on through. My 
All right, once you get those in, there's three more that go in. Again, there's detailed information on the V1 website. Drop your skateboard bearing on. There's 608 RSs, I think. There's 608 bearings anyway. The one's a metal shield, and the other one's a rubber seal. They say seven, seven inch pounds or something. You definitely don't want this plastic stuff too tight. Then these just slide right on a rail. And like mine are already pretty snug. I don't have to tighten up the tension bolts. That one was really tight. I got I got the bolt too tight, and I had to loosen it up so it slides. They have to do it more. Huh. There it is. If it's too tight or too loose, these bolts are the ones that tension it up. <laughs> 